Don't forget to press the subscribe button and click the bell icon to stay up to date with all our videos. Okay, so as we have discussed before, we would like to have a speech recognition as well. So let's go and find a speech recognition package. All right, so I'll just write npm react speech. I think I have it already. So I don't have it installed, so I will just install it and I'll have to do speech. Okay. Shouldn't auto start it. Okay, perfect. Because I need to add it via yarn. So yarn add speech recognition, which is great. Okay, so till that thing installs, let me show you how are we gonna use it. So we will be having a different component for speech, and that speech is going to have a few of this inbuilt parameters. The transcript is the one which we like we write or whatever we say something is gonna put it as a transcript and we need to modify it in such a way that it doesn't continuously keep taking our audio so there's like a couple of ways to doing it and the one way which i found useful was a start listening and stop listening so when i press a button it's supposed to start listening and when i like don't press i i take the mouse off it's supposed to stop listening so we will be doing that let me see if we have installed it and this is installed so let me go there and see if i can okay let me create a function uh file so it's supposed to be in the input so speech.js which is good in speech i will copy and paste the whole thing which we have here so let us copy oh, copy and paste till this point and we have it so at this point i need to add a couple of functions to it as they have shown in the documentation one is start listening the other will be stop listening so stop listening which is good start listening prop type start function stop listening prop type start function great so at this point what are we going to do is let me first show you how this thing looks like so if i go into input i can just place it right here speech and it's going to auto import it and you can see it's going to ask me for the permission to use it so let's see what happens see it's listening i think it took my permission before and it just started doing it yeah see it it keeps on listening <laughs> okay keeps on this me <laughs> It's funny. Okay, so uh, let me first of all stop this guy. So I can do it from here and we can, in the speech one, we can do one thing. That instead of the reset button, I'll need to add this function, options to it. So var options equals to there are like a couple of options which they suggest so options and in this options it's going to be continuous is one thing let me just go to the documentation this guy don't want to stop at all okay so here was it where was it global function auto start we will set it to false okay auto start is false so this thing won't start right away but the good thing is that it's gonna auto reset so we can handle that as well here listen and in this listen instead of on click we don't really need on click we need on mouse down start 
listening on mouse up stop listening great so this is what we want and let's let's see if this thing is working so listen is something as you see this guy is not listening at all check check perfect so if I click it that's when it works else it doesn't so this is something what we want so let's try to do one thing let's try to put this guy into the state so how are we gonna do that so we can do that in one way and that way is passing down props to it so I can pass in a prop const update word equals to word and set of word equals to word perfect so I'll just pass this guy into the speech and let's try if this works update word update word okay set word is not something which this guy is want so we need to do it in a different way okay so we don't need a set word at this point we need a on search because we are not setting anything on search word and if it's an error it's gonna stay change the error state so which is great so I think this should work uh, and find word let's make it a more sensible name and give it a sensible name so find word from speech okay find word from speech it looks like it should work find word from speech find words word from speech and in the speech one let me put it in this way find word from speech and when I have this guy stop listening so that's a transcript so in this transcript I can have a function const find that by speech transcript I just want to check how many times this guy is calling it so when there's a I don't want this guy to go on forever console log calling okay well let's see Is a console calling it just called once at this point and hello called four times hello great so it's being updated but now the issue is that I just wanted to call it once so just once one two three four five see it did a bunch of calling so what we will be doing is on mouse up that's when we will be calling this function so I can do this console or hmm, it's the same one right so yeah let's do this const call API if hmm, at this point I will have to call the stop function but before that bef uh, yeah I can I can stop the function beforehand stop uh, stop listening 
and in this one I can call the transcript yeah so find word from speech can call it here and I can just do it once call API I think this should work I'm having this thing twice so okay let's give it a try it called it once hello hello listen okay so it's not clearing the transcript so knock knock keeps adding to it so that's not something what we want so let's see how are we gonna do that 